Howdy y'all, I'm Round the Wheel, you're watching Yvonne's Remons, and last time, uh, actually last time I skipped a cutscene between the end of last time and the beginning of here, but it's not a super important cutscene. Basically it just told us a couple of things. One, Dysis is in this for the money, she loves money, she's kind of ashamed of the fact that she loves money, but she's willing to admit it. And two is kind of something I think we all sort of figured, which is that uh, she mentioned something about, boy, you're a lot older than you seem, and Clover is like, what, what, huh, what's that supposed to mean? Which I think kind of tells me what we were, uh, what a lot of us probably have suspected, including myself, which is that, uh, Clover has been here a long time and is much older than he is letting on. I kind of think, you know, Dice is, he says he was looking for a cure for his sister's health issue, uh, my theory tends to be that she had some kind of congenital birth defect. Clover came to the island to find a cure for it, uh, has been here way longer than he realizes, and in the meantime, science found a cure for whatever she had, and it's not really a going concern anymore. That's my working theory right now, but let's see how it plays out. We're here in... Ooh, we're here at the uh, nice little skyscraper. This must be... Is that a... Yeah, I can't see anything except a really cool tower in the distance. Is that a tower? Yes. Yeah, is that uh, Upbring's new base of operations? The backgrounds just get prettier and prettier as you go through this game. It's really something. Okay, so here we go. Puzzle number one for today. What's up? Nothing we haven't seen before, so let's give it a shot. So that bops to there. Can I get to there from here? No, I cannot. So, alright, so we go to here, and that takes us to here, okay, alright, okay, so what we want to do then is probably go from here to here, and then that, okay, yeah, hmm, okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna do the bop, looks like. So I'm going to go ahead and get this open. Wait, no, I'm going to set this up up here. And then, well, no, I can't get that set up up there for now. Not if I want to get to... Okay, this is going to be a bit of a problem, because here we go to here. Then we jump off of here. Alright, let's go to here. Okay, yeah, that gets us up to here, but as soon as I jump up to here, this is going to go away. And then this... Okay, so I have to figure out how to get... How to have that thing teleported up. Okay. Alright, so what if we go to here, do this, jumble it around a little. Okay. I think I had. that's how I had it earlier, though. Okay, so what if we do... Hmm... What if we do this? And then... Go to here. Okay, once again, there can't be too many... There can't be too much to this. I have to be able to... There's not many pieces in play here, so, again, it's something I'm not looking at. Okay, so if I go from here to here, that doesn't really get me anywhere, except it redoes that. Okay, I have to figure out how to get the loop going here. I cannot jump from here to here. My head stops me. And the thing's always... There's not really gonna be much... Okay, I can't get on top of that from a... Can't get on top of that from here or anywhere. So how can I make it so that I get... So I can get... The, the little green teleport, the little green block has to be at the top of the rail. Or maybe not. Maybe I just have to get it to 
here. Okay. Okay, yeah. But I can't turn... I can't turn the rail. I can't change the position of the small green block. Both of the blocks, both of these blocks that I'm standing on, make both things happen. So how do I get up to the very tippy top? Good question. Well, why don't we just jump from right here? Will that give us the height we need? Oh yeah, that'll just, okay, yeah, that's pretty simple. All right, so going on from there, what do we see Clover here in this brave new tower? Oh, oh, a mystery individual. Okay, that seems to be a pretty good guess somehow, and that tower might be it. Uh-huh. With the electromagnetic field. But now it's not. Right. Uh, are you sure that's Clover you're talking to? That's a pretty that's a pretty shadowy silhouette right there. I think you're maybe think you're maybe spilling too many beans here, Dice. <laughs> oh, my anxiety is spiking. Oh, so she thinks Upbring created the notebook. What does who think? That is not Clover Dices. Oh, I'm walking you forward into a trap here, and I don't like it. I don't like it, not one bit. So we've got a reset. We've got a reset button here. Okay. So this moves this over here. All right. And to get to here, all right, so now, all right, where do we want to go here? We don't have a big springy bounce thing. Okay, I don't see how, okay, we've got to get this over to here. Okay, there we go. And that, okay, that gets that going there. So now we have to... Let's see. Okay, if we go from here... Bring this... Let's bring this back for the time being. We should be able to... Go down here. Zip this back over here. Oh no. No, not quite. Oh yeah, I have no way of teleporting now. That was silly of me. So, okay. So I think, okay, let's reset real quick. So we get on, we want that over there. Get that going there, make this happen. Go back to here. I can kind of already see how this one works. I just goofed it the first time. So we want to get onto this now. Take that. Get that going here, so that we can teleport up to here. And yeah, boom, there we go, done. All right, yeah, that one was pretty simple, okay. Uh, like they say, the difficulty curve is all over the place because of the translations of the words and stuff, so some puzzles are gonna be really hard and they're just right there in the middle of whatever we're doing. And some puzzles are gonna be really easy. And it's all just going to be a jumbly mishmash. It does kind of, it is kind of a clever diegetic way of 
explaining the weird difficulty curve. I, I kind of I kind of dig it. Like it's jank, but it's story approved jank. Why am I not getting news from anybody? Uh, this is there is no news here. The news of the outside world is the outside world is nothing here. Okay, so all right, we've got more. Okay, I can kind of get behind these uh, rail moving shenanigans. What have we got? Okay, obviously to do anything, I need this one to come here. Okay, so that goes up to there. And now, get this bop into here. Okay. Alright, and then that goes to there. Alright, and then that gets that going. Okay. And then you go from here, and then you jump to here. Oh yeah, this one is super easy. Oh yeah, the the ones with two different color of rails, I'm into those. But I'm into those puzzles. Those puzzles are very easy, and we're just going puzzle, puzzle, puzzle. And boy, this is a pure puzzle day, and I am loving it. Okay, all right. So now, okay, now we've got something a little different. What are these deals here? Well, these go, these stay here no matter what. But I have a feeling this can actually make green platforms go away. Oh. Oh, we can change the type of platform it is. Oh, okay, well, I think we would want it to be a jumpy one, right? So we can get up to here and make this a thing. Okay, and that's going to turn it into that, yes. Okay, so quick introduction to a new kind of, a new kind of thing that can transform blocks. Okay, that's a cool, that's a cool puzzle type and a nice little tutorial there. Okay, we're back to the shadowy figure. Is everything okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, you could do that. Oh, we got a Lysander on our hands here. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, that is the appropriate reaction to that kind of remark. She's already way ahead of Professor Sycamore in that department. Okay, so this guy knows who she is. This this must be this may be the mysterious Evan. Oh my gosh, she said a wordy dirt. Alright, so we're moving. Oh yeah, it could be. It could be. That voice, you've heard it somewhere else. <gasps> Maybe it's the voice of, I don't know, like, maybe, say, Nicola? I don't know. Oh, so here we go. Something else is happening now. Are we back to the bungalow? We sure are. You can kind of feel when the game is headed in that direction, I think. Looks like he's home alone right now, though. Nothing to do. No one to play Spy Master with. It's almost time. It's almost time for the nightly game of Spy Master. He's out translate a fine tonight, probably. Something has happened to him though. There he is. There's our boy Clover. Since he got bored as all get out. So Vincent knows Dices too. So they are keeping tabs on her. They're in on it together. Wake her up. Okay, so she's in some kind of... She's in some kind of coma? This is a dream kind of thing? Mm-hmm. 
Uh, the plot thickens. The plot thickens indeed. Your face is glorious. <laughs> huh. So if Vincent wins this game of Spy Master, he gets the house, which makes me think he has something up his sleeve. <laughs> oh, no, that's not true, Clover. Showed up at just the right time to sign the deed. To sign on the line which is dotted. There is some weird stuff going on here, and I do not know what to make of it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I could get used to a house like that. It looks pretty roomy. You could start over. Live in peace. Run away forever. All right. It's priceless. Oh. I think it does. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> Fair. No, I think you've got him rattled a fair bit. This has got to be the best game you ever played, Vincent. Who's going to win? Who is going to... Alright, we're entering the Spy Master Dome. Two men enter, one man leaves. Or one man gets the house, you know, whatever. So, okay, those scenes usually... Oh, wow. So now we are at the uh, electric waterworks here. Got this nice little foreground fence in front of us. Man, the backgrounds just get better and better all the time. That's a great stopping place for now. We are going to call it quits right there. Join us next time for more. Uh, this one was pretty heavy on puzzle solving, I think, which is which is rare. God, those clowns look so nice. I could, you know, the the shadow guy is right. You could stare at these backgrounds for just for just hours. They are just they are just so pretty.